I don't know what to expect. I bet it's going to be really fractured though, just because of the bottom. Whew. We'll see. In this video, I'm going to be cutting open some thunder eggs from Turkey, I think. So the reason I said I think when I said we're cutting open thunder eggs from Turkey is because these pieces right here have this really weird funky crumbly host to them. And we're cutting open five of these in this video and they really, really remind me of thunder eggs. Some of the other ones I've cut from here in the States, they look just like that. So I am kind of assuming that these are thunder eggs from Turkey. Let's check out our very first one. Oh, it's so dark. So, so dark. Just a little blip right down in here. Hmm. I'm gonna cut another one. I wanna see what's going on in, in another one of these. Let's cut this guy right here. I'm worried that these fractures are gonna be so deep. Hard to say. You don't wanna cut into these fractures and they're in every direction. Man, I don't know. I'll look it over a little bit and then we'll go from there. I don't know what to expect. I bet it's gonna be really fractured though, just cause of the bottom. Whew, we'll see. Oh, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? <laughs> it does have some fractures, but I, <laughs> I didn't expect that at all. Man, this one looks like the top part of Minnesota. Just missing the rest of it. And like over here, that is so crazy. Wow. Man, we cut that perfectly. Think if you cut it like, like if I would have cut it this way for surface area, we would have just gone right through there, man. I don't know, maybe this way. I like that better. That is so cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I want to cut another one now. Oh, here's the next one. We got this funky little butt on there. I bet it's gonna be really, really dark. We won't know till we cut it. I didn't think this one would have this. <laughs> that is so crazy. Wow. This one, for whatever reason, just makes me feel a little nervous because for the size of it, it was a fairly quick cut. So I'm thinking, I just wonder how deep that goes before you start getting to... <laughs> oh man, there's just like half. It's so blue, it's so pretty though. Man, that butt, it's kind of cool seeing that though, you know? There it is on the bottom, and that's just how far it runs up into that, you know, that host rock there. They're just wild, you know? You just, you never know. You go from getting that zebra stripe to just super, super creamy. Interesting. I forgot to show you that um, our last cut is this guy. <laughs> this thing is enormous, and I don't know what to expect. Um, I don't even know where to cut this thing. The next guy is not so big. It's just really, really interesting. I'm gonna cut it a bunch of times. I'm gonna do my best not to look and then we'll just look at them together. I changed my mind. I'm gonna cut it through there once. We'll look at it and then we'll see if we'll do that. I am excited to see inside this one and I bet you are too it's kind of funky but before we take a peek at it let me tell you a little bit about where I got these awesome thunder eggs from Turkey I got all of those thunder eggs from SRL gemstones and I have a lot more from them that I'm gonna be cutting and polishing in the future but I will have their eBay and Etsy store linked in the description box below so you can go check out what they have on their stores now we can take a peek 
The sweet thunder egg? Is it sweet? Oh, it's so sweet! Man, those bands... Oh, can you even see it? Yeah, they're just kind of ghostly. How did I get... Oh my gosh, that is so crazy. Sorry, I'm looking at it in real life here. You can see them right there. That's actually really cool. I think I'm going to leave that one as is. That's pretty sweet. And I think... I don't know. I might be able to give that a rounded face polish. Just kind of... That's pretty cool. It's got these really, really neat bands down in here. Love that they have the little black accents in there, too. The blues. We got a lot of the blues. Yeah. That is really, really neat. These are so different. I love cutting open this different stuff that I've never really seen before and then sharing with all of you. I hope you guys are enjoying it. If you are, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button. And uh, if you're new, hit that subscriber follow. We got a lot of other fun cutting stuff coming up in the future as well. But folks, we have our last cut. It's gonna be blue, because you can see it. And hopefully there's some black in there. And I'm hoping that that runs in through here. Gosh. So this is kinda, it kinda reminds me of this right here. Similar to that, we got that in there. I think the best option is to cut it through here. It's gonna be the biggest surface area, but I think it'll be good. I think it'll be worth it. If it's not, I will say I'm wrong. We'll see. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so hard. I had to rotate that a bunch of times. Really hope that this is a good one. Oh, let me just adjust this one. <laughs> I just got done showing this to you, except for whatever reason when I adjusted, I accidentally hit the stop button. So I know what's inside here. You don't know what's inside here. You get the reveal. I already had mine. <laughs> oh, isn't that pretty though? Man, I just went over and looked at this whole thing in depth and all that. Golly. It's the worst when that happens. It rarely does. What a stinker. I was pretty excited. And I was also saying this is my second, very, very close second favorite. That one with the white bands. Hard to beat that. That's pretty insane. But those black lines in there, like right there under my thumb, throughout the whole thing, really, it's just like... I wouldn't want it to have cut it any other way. I think this is awesome. I think it would be really fun to polish. As it gets warmer out, I think I'm going to be able to polish bigger stuff like this. Got something set up. Something's in the works, folks. They look like arrowheads, doesn't it? Totally. But <laughs> this one that I thought was going to be the worst <laughs> oh, is the absolute best my favorite you have to let me know what your favorite is thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while i cut these awesome thunder eggs everything is going to be linked below the description for all the links for the srl gemstones the saw that i used in this and all the accessories and all that good stuff thank you all so much for joining me this was a blast so unique and so different we'll see you next time